Okay, hi. So as the title says, I'm going to talk about, um, these are the NYX Jumbo eyeshadow pencils, and I'm going to show you which ones they are. And also I'm going to talk about the MAC and the Maybelline, because these are the only uh, ones I have, but these are, these have a different name. These are paint sticks, and the Maybelline, it has a different name too. These are cream shadow sticks, so yeah. So I have different ones. I don't have all of them. There you can see the color. But I'm going to review over them. This is uh, called Black Bean. Just as the name says, I'm going to... There you go. You see it? It's black. It's a paint stick. So you can use these ones either by themselves or you can use them with a paint pod or an eyeshadow base and just paint only by, by MAC. I know Maybelline comes with paint pods too. Um, their own eyeshadow bases. L'Oreal has an eyeshadow base but it comes in a wand and then um, Urban Decay has their their also their their wand that is an eyeshadow base. Okay so this one is in black bean and just as the name says it's black and look at the pigmentation is you can make like a smoky eye with this one and this these eyeshadow um, pencils um, or paint sticks or whatever. These are mainly a base before you put your eyeshadow. So, for instance, for me today, what I did was I used put these ones down. I used strawberry milk, and it's a pink. Let me put it alongside. It's a pink. It's very pretty. It's a baby pink. And I put it all over my lid, but before that I put paint only by MAC. And then on top of that, I used the, um, the trio from Wet n Wild. And it's the walking on eggshells. And I used the bottom one, the one that says uh, eyelid. And it has, it's very shimmery pink. You see that? Then on top of that, I used soft brown and then brulee. But the eyeliner I used, I'm going to show you. I used slate which is a gray one so you can even use these ones as well for um if you wanted to as a waterline that's what I did today or you can use it um for your eyeliner on top so this is a gray one and then I use black bean today for my waterline a little bit though I don't know if you can tell that was great too and then I have this one this is french fries and this is very pretty this one is a bronzy color that's the best way of me describing it and you can use this one with, if you have the urban decay I have this palette I don't have more palettes from urban decay but I would suggest smog sorry it fell the eyeliner and that's a very pretty color that you can pair it with pair with so that's cool you know okay next one is let me put it away I have the purple it's called purple I'll give you a swatch but this one is more like um a bright purple so if you have um I think it's called flash by urban decay you can wear that one or you can wear purple that would be pretty to go along with that one is um makeup forever's um i don't know i don't know the number because i don't have the eyeshadow but i heard that one is great and then obviously this one is milk it's a white one this one is very pretty this one would be great as a base to to put on your eyeshadow but let's say you have I'm gonna give you an example. You let's because I'm wearing green. <laughs> you have this eyeshadow, right? And it's kind of like um a mossy green, and this is by NYX and it's called Green Ice Pearl. So I'm always having a hard time opening these eyeshadows. So I'm gonna use my helper. <laughs> and let's say for instance that your eyeshadow is a little bit too dark, but you don't want to spend money on a lighter eyeshadow. All you do is because I want to make sure I get it close to the camera. Hold on. It's like you needed to put it on top, right? And look at the eyeshadow. It's going to change. 
you see how it became lighter? And I'm gonna give you a swatch just of the eyeshadow by itself. <laughs> Obviously you have to um, blend in the white one, but there you go. And I'm gonna show you blend it so you get a, a difference of how it's gonna look on your eyelids. Cause it's like you want to save money. You don't. You don't have to really spend money on a lot of eyeshadows. So that's this is the one by itself, and this is blended together. So it gives gives a different different look. So you don't have to spend money. There you go. Okay, now these ones come in a different packaging. It's silver. I don't know why, but this one is called bronze. And I'm going to put it right here. This one is bronze, like bronze. This one is much more of um, although it's bronze, but it's more like a brown color. This one is much more of a, it has that reddish undertones in it. And it's pretty. I think it's very pretty. There you go. You see the swatches? This one is bronze right there. And the other one was called French fries right here. Okay, the next one that I have in the same packaging is cottage cheese. Cottage cheese. Now, this one, let me see. Let me put it alongside this one right here. This one, I'm not crazy about the smell, though. This one doesn't have a scent, a scent to it, but this one does. Okay, so anyways, this one actually smells like cottage cheese for real. <laughs> it's like, um, how do I describe this one? It's uh, white, but it has silver in it. This one right here. You can't really tell. There you go. You see the shimmers? Yeah, it's white with silver. Okay, so that's NYX, right? So I'm going to do the only Maybelline I have. Now, if you, have, if you don't have a green eyeshadow base, if you don't have your eyeshadow base color that goes along with your eyeshadow, don't worry. Just use uh, a white one. Okay, so this one is the only one I found. I think it was a limited edition. I And right now I think it's permanent. And it's the Maybelline Eye Express Cream Shadow Sticks. And this one is in number 500 Minty. I don't know if you can tell of the lighting. So, like it says its name. It's much more of a lighter um, mint green. I don't have a green um, pink eyeshadow pencils from NYX so this is the only one I have and I'm gonna layer it on right there there you go right this one right here you see how it doesn't show up it's not showing up but it's a very light mint green it's not gonna show as much it has that um I would say more of a blue undertone in it and it's very pretty okay the next one I have these are the only two uh, paint, paint sticks from MAC they're called if you go to the Mac store, these are called paint sticks and grease paint. Well, this one is a grease paint stick, and these one, this one, it doesn't have a name anymore, but I, but I know the name of it. Okay, so this one is called Slick Black, and I think this one came. I don't know if it came in a collection. I don't remember. And I used to have a different one too, but not anymore. So this one is a black one. Just like the other one, remember, but this one is much more of a matte black, and this one has a little bit of a glossiness into it. There you go. And you can do a lot of smoky eyes with this one. It's cool. And then this one is, I don't have a name for it, but I know the name. It's Topographic. It was a limited edition, and it came out in the Warm and Cozy collection, which came out a long time ago. By Mac, and I'm gonna put it right here. It's a taupe color, but it's a pretty. It's a mix between taupe and brown. So there you go. That's a. Sorry, bad swatch, but there you go. So yeah. So if let's say for instance that you don't have money to buy a paint pot color, a color for every paint pot. To go along with your shadow just buy these ones because these are way more inexpensive cheaper the nyx because the mac are pretty pretty
pretty pricey. I think I paid either between, it was less than 20, like around, I think, $16.99. I'm not sure. I don't remember. And then the Eye Express, I think it was $5.99. I don't, I don't remember. It was a long time ago. So these ones, they have it on sale on Ulta always. Sometimes they have it buy one, get one free. Or you can buy them at the website, at the NYX website. And these are cool. I love them. Yeah, so that's a good idea, you know, in case you don't want to buy these ones. Because these, these are these are not cheap. But they last a long time. And the only thing about these ones that I don't like about the paint pots is that once, once they dry, once air gets in, it dries up really quickly. So you have to be careful with these ones. The Maybelline, I don't have Maybelline paint pots. The eyeshadow base I don't so I can't really tell you um, how it works but I heard great things about them so I would suggest investing on these ones because I think they cost like around they used to cost $1.99 and then they change it up to $2.99 but still like think about it three six nine like if you think about them these are way cheaper than just one of these guys so you get more bang for your buck and these ones i had them for for a long time and they don't even dry so i would suggest these ones instead so i mean this is like if you want to save money you know i'm just saying save money by, by the nyx okay and that's pretty much it and i hope everybody's having a good day my son is sleeping so <laughs> hopefully i can do another video okay and if anybody is wondering what i'm wearing on my lips is the because i always say what's on my lips it's the rimmel moisture renew 220 in pink chic that's the name of it and um it's a pinky one but it's a light pink much more of a wearable pink than the other one <laughs> that i have and then uh, let's see what else as a top, as a lip gloss, I love the NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss. And this one is in Pink Frost, number 127. It's very pretty too. Let me give you a swatch because you guys probably are wondering. Like, ladies, <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's a pinky frost. And it looks, it looks very nice on the lips. I love this lips, lip gloss. <laughs> Yeah, if you guys want me to do a tutorial, just let me know what kind of tutorial you guys want to do. I'm open to any tutorial, but I think I have to do it in, in either in the kitchen, because I have better lighting, I think, than in here. Because right here, I have to get really close, and I don't know if you guys can really tell the pigmentation of my colors <laughs> that I have. So, yeah. Okay. And bye.